Hi, I'm Carl, and in this video we're going to have a look at questions 22 and 23. So this is a question about lens, and we're given the lens equation and the magnification equation. Um, we're also told that there's a rectangular plate that's 2 times 3 centimetres uh, in dimensions, and we're dealing with a lens of focal length 20 centimetres. So we'll write that in straight away. Okay, so question 22 says if the plate is positioned 30 centimeters from the lens, the distance of its real image from the lens will be what? Okay, so we can use this first equation uh, to work this out. We know that one over the focal length, which is 20, is gonna be one over the distance between the lens and the plate. So that's gonna be 30 centimeters in this case. Now it leaves us with one over V, and we'll just solve for V. So one over 20 minus one over 30 is going to be one over V. So we can change this to 3 over 60 minus 2 over 60 it goes 1 over v 1 over v therefore 1 over 60 so v is 60 centimeters or answer d what about question 23 then it says if the plate is positioned 30 centimeters from the lens as before the dimensions of the rectangular image formed on the screen will be what so we're given an equation uh, that gives us the magnitude of magnification. In other words, that's the uh, value that we can multiply the dimensions by in order to get the new dimensions of the image. So this is the equation that we're given. Uh, and we know V and U, so we know V is going to be 60 and U is 30. So that gives us uh, a value of M of 2. So if M equals 2. Uh, we're also told that this is going to be the ratio of the heights, which is true also for a converging lens for the widths. Um, so we know that the original dimensions is 2 by 3, and so we want to multiply this by 2. So we end up with an image that um, is 4 by 6, if we're multiplying by our magnitude of magnification. And that gives us an answer then for number 23 of C. So that was a couple of questions on lenses. I hope that helped. Thanks for watching.